Bam. Isn't that cool? Whole thing's done, right? Look at that. It's awesome. All right, yard's doing pretty good here. Spring going into summer, but had a little mishap here, didn't we, man? Yeah, some of the, well, not some of the, just died. Yeah, two years ago at the beginning of winter, uh, it was about zero degrees for about two weeks straight, and these guys died. And we kind of thought they might try to come back. Doesn't look like they're gonna, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> these strawberry guys have filled in underneath, and that's probably what we're gonna do is let those just kind of fill in that area. We've let those do a lot of the ground cover around here, but we got to take these out. Luckily, we have the jaw saw, right? Yeah. Putting the jaw saw back in action. We've used it several times since we've got it. It's super awesome. The one on this side kind of tried to survive just here on the tip here, but it's not really cutting it. So we're just going to take all these out. If strawberries don't fill in here, we might just plant some strawberries, put up some trellises here, and I don't know, maybe grow some bigger strawberries and eat them. Look at this fern, though. It's nuts. So anyway, Jack's going to cut these guys out. And, uh, I mean, this jaw saw is just, it's killer, man. It can do anything. These little bush, especially because they're dead, is just going to annihilate them. So we're just going to cut all this down, throw them all in our arrow cart, take them into the, uh, <laughs> take them into the uh, fire pit and burn them all probably next weekend or something like that. But this thing is fantastic. All right, we're going to just knock this out and then be back and show you. It probably only takes about five or ten minutes. Because it all comes together. Look. Yeah. One big. If you get it down low enough. These things are sharp, man. They're like really dead. They're going to go up like in one second, they're going to burn. Yeah. Leave that big milkweed there. We'll try to see if we can get that to stay. This thing's awesome, isn't it? That's the best. We just pushed right down on it. All right, that didn't take long at all. Only a few minutes. Cut all those suckers out. I'm going to go throw those in the fire pit. Jess going to start working on this side. And, uh, yeah, I'll probably just rake this up kind of thing and let this strawberry kind of fill in here. Probably fill in just a week or two if we water it and that. All right, so I went to dump the other one, came back, and he already loaded this one up almost done. This thing is incredibly fast and awesome. This big hosta back in here is getting flowers already coming out of it. This side doesn't get as much sun, but maybe this pack of sand will fill it in. Whatever. Whatever grows in there, we'll let it grow in there, right? Yeah. That thing's kind of fun to use, isn't it? Yeah, it's kind of heavy, too. It, it gets heavy after a minute, but a it's got the Ergo Dynamic handle on it, right? Yeah. See that? You can hit the thing from the side real low. And just whammo. Just push. Bam. Isn't that cool? Whole thing's done, right? Look at that. It's awesome. Done. All right, there you go. Jack and the jaw saw made easy work of that. Probably take one of these big old stumps over here and uh, put it on top weigh it all down pack it down and then we'll light it up another night when it's cooler or whatever um totally awesome by the way we did a video on this guy a long time ago when we got him this is the um arrow cart so it's like a, a wheelbarrow that turns into a dolly and then this thing comes up we did some videos on it a long time ago when we first got it but they do this thing on sale all the time for like father's day memorial day labor day all those kind of things and you can get a really good deal on it, especially if you buy something else with it. The handles come off and turn around. Again, it stands up, makes a dolly. This whole arm thing comes forward. You can do tons of stuff with this. You can take the handles off, put it in the back of your car. We usually take it to Grandma's when we go over there and work. We're actually heading over there tomorrow. That's why we're getting this done today. We're taking the jaw saw with us and doing some stuff over there. But let's go up here in the front and uh, see if Jack's done cleaning up up there. I had to get a shot of the clematis when I was passing by. It kind of fell down. It got so heavy, it actually fell down during a storm. So it's kind of crawling onto the uh, the bench there. But yeah, it's looking good. We did all the trimming and stuff a while ago, but everything's doing well. The yard's looking great. Look at how green everything is. All right, it looks great, guys. It's really kind of weird seeing everything without those. They've been here since the house was built. We actually looked on Google, and they were here the whole time. I never really liked them, to be honest with you. I kind of wanted to open it up. So uh, glad we did it. We, uh, we used this, uh, this is a 32 volt little works blower. Got that a long time ago when I got like my first uh, edger trimmer. And that's more of not really like a leaf blower, but a patio blower. And you can see it kind of blew everything off of here. We did let some of these strawberry guys grow in a little bit just because we thought it looked cool. But then we kind of vinegared these ones just to kind of keep it back a little bit. 
but uh, I like it kind of more open. We're going to have to pressure wash this next time we water, maybe tomorrow or the next day off the rain barrels with the works hydro shots. Kind of pressure wash those spider webs and that and clean that up. Probably just going to let everything, nature, take its course. Let stuff grow in here and that and fill in. Pack of Sandra and stuff will fill this in. But I think it looks pretty neat. How do you think it looks, man? Yeah, it's pretty cool. Great job, it's man. a lot more open now. Yeah. How much battery's left on there? Let's take a look. Uh, what, oh, yeah. <laughs> So like two thirds. We two used. thirds we used, about one third left. Yeah. So not bad. I mean, to, how many cuts would you say? I mean, I don't know, twenty or thirty cuts. Yeah, probably. You know, maybe more. Um, again, that's only twenty-five volt battery, a pretty pretty small one. So anyway, super cool. Got our last aero cart full of stuff. We're gonna take it back. Kind of glad we knocked this out. Really didn't take long as at all. We're gonna hit the pool, right? Yep. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. -bye. At least that's a big pile, huh? Look at that sucker. Whoa. <laughs> What'd you find? Did you find something? Get it. Get it.